Hi everyone! DIY Friday! Oh, I love the enthusiasm Why am I so today. excited? I'm <laughs> loving the enthusiasm. So, as you guys know, I've been on this like obsession for healthier hair lately. She has. I and if you guys don't know, let me tell bar. you. <laughs> I've been trying to get my hair healthy because I feel like it's not growing. So. It's getting shorter. It, Without getting a haircut. It? Is it? <laughs> no, no, I'm just saying that's what we feel that's like. That's what I feel like. <laughs> so today we are going to show you guys how to do a natural home detangling spray. It can also be used as a um, light leave-in conditioner. And the, the thing about detangling sprays, um, you know, I've used some detangling sprays in the past, like back in the day, and I feel like I started to lose hair. That's from, interesting. From detangling sprays because there's so much crap in there yeah. that like... I don't know, I, I had a bad reaction to them. But what I love about this in recipe that you've concocted is that it's all natural and it's actually good for your yeah, hair. Yeah, it really is. You're a genius, I you're a genius. <laughs> Tell me more. Tell me more. Okay, don't get spoiled. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> this works best on damp hair, of course. So we are gonna dampen up my hair before we do it. But first, let's get to the ingredients. Vitamin E oil, I mean we've used this a thousand times, so hopefully you guys have it on hand. Our favorite, favorite essential oil. Lavender. Lavender. And this is actually a new product that we started to use in our DIYs and it's vegetable glycerine. Um, this has a lot of benefits, it's going to seal in moisture for your hair. Um, but one note, don't ever use it raw like this. Always, always, always make sure that you're diluting it with water or else it will strip your hair um, dry. And if you have colored hair, it can strip the color off your hair. So we're only gonna be using one tablespoon of this for our entire mixture. Um, but when used properly, it's actually really good for your hair. It moisturizes your hair. Yeah. So, yeah. And of course, some water. Okay, so we are gonna take uh, the vegetable glycerine and we're gonna do, like I said, one tablespoon. I need to smell it first. Okay, doesn't smell like anything. Okay. And next we're gonna do half a teaspoon of vitamin E oil. Now we're gonna take some water and we're gonna dilute it. I have about a cup of water in here. I'm just gonna fill the entire thing up. You can already smell the lavender I know. oil. And it's just like, we haven't even done anything yet. <sighs> okay, I'm just gonna put a few drops. Nothing aggressive. We always go aggressive. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, that's good. Shake it up. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, so shake, like shake. like I said, this works best on uh, damp hair, so we actually just have a plain oh, yeah. water bottle here, and Nora's gonna dampen up my hair so that we can do the detangler. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Beyonce with a fan, except I'm getting wet. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, it's definitely okay. Let's mess up your hair so we could detangle it. <laughs> that actually feels so good. Okay. Now it's tangled so we could detangle her hair. <laughs> Does it look good? You woke up like this. <laughs> okay. okay, let's take our mixture. So do you put this on um, like after a shower? Or? After a shower or um, you know, after you towel dry your hair a little bit. Like I said, you can either use it as a leave-in conditioner or after you come out of the shower. Oh, look how quickly it's brushing. All right, how does your hair feel? It feels really soft. It was really easy to brush out yeah, after I good. used this product. And chances are you guys already have all of these products. If you don't, you can get them at um, Whole Foods. We got the vitamin E from CVS, so. You or know, Amazon. Or Amazon, there you go. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this DIY. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching everyone. Make sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking here. Check out our DIY sheet mask and Nivea aftershave primer. 